They say God will send mysterious ways, but I can't think of why He would take you away. Trying to deal with the pain, steady praying for strength. Oh. She wants to be drinking her tetita and watching TV. Hey guys, welcome back to Aguilar's. Welcome back to a new vlog. So today we are here in Sunnyside, California. Why Sunnyside? I don't know, I'm just saying. Oh. I just like. So guys, we are here in Covina, California today. We came literally for a day. Mm -hmm. We were supposed to be here on Sunday for other stuff. The plans ended up being canceled, which kind of worked out for us a little because we actually ended up going to our Norris birthday party the night before and we were so desvelados. Yeah. So we got up and then just drove over here. And today, Angelique has her Christmas photo shoot. So mm -hmm. we're very excited for that. No one in AZ, at least I have not seen anyone in AZ do this photo shoot. I was kind of looking for someone out there and I couldn't find it. So I knew the perfect girl, the one that took my maternity photos, and I love how she takes photos. So I was like, okay, so I'll just drive over there to her. Mm -hmm. And before Christmas is over, because Angelique hasn't had her Christmas photo shoot, I can't wait to show you guys what we're doing for her. Also guys, on the way over here, we witnessed a car crash. <gasps> it was right in front of us. We were driving, oh we were getting close to Covina, and there was this guy that was driving reckless uh, on a black Honda. He was and like- He swerved. He was and swerving. Then, aside and from out. far away, I already knew they were going to crash. As soon as they hit, guys, I was looking at the car and I was about to tell Nestor, hey, that guy se va a estrellar. You know, like if he doesn't mm -hmm. stop, and that's when it happened. Yeah, that's when it happened. They hit, and when they hit, one of the cars were spinning. And I, was, I, was, I seen him like going like backwards, so I already know he's going to end up in the middle of the road. So I was going kind of slow, and the guy that was in the, my right lane hit him, he T-boned him like really like hard. And one of the cars came spinning yeah, towards so us like, and stopped right in front of us. Yeah, so we just swerved everything around the, the car, but... If you would have been going a little bit faster, mm -hmm. it would have been... I think if I'd have been, I would have been in that lane, I would have hit T-bone that guy. Yeah. yeah so. You were you had just moved, también, no? Mm-hmm. That was crazy. And we were like, oh my God, guys, like... That was crazy, guys. We and just, I like, witnessed a whole three-car crash. And I ended up calling the cops because yeah. I was like, they need help and... Well, we, we, you can't stay there, you know, yeah. but I, we're so thankful guys that it wasn't us like he literally came spinning and he could have like Hit us mm -hmm. by a hair. No nos pegó. We wanted to show you guys this clip of our Norris birthday party because um, we surprised him with Something special. Let me show it to you guys and then I'll explain to you guys why these are so special to him so, so, We brought you a gift You will know why we gifted you. No, that was his favorite ones. Yeah. He got a bag? Yeah. <laughs> we bought him. We got We Imagine next road trip he loses him again. <laughs> Get your negative hey, vibes out of here, Jonathan. Hey, if you lose them again. I'm not. If you lose them again. Hey, if he loses them again, it was not meant to be for sure. 
Uh, <laughs> hey, if you lose those slides again, bro, it was not no. meant to be. They were not meant for you. So, guys, there's a little story behind these chanclas. These chanclas. They were the yakis, the like yakitas. Uh huh. Because <laughs> we had them all the time. You guys are probably like, oh my god, they're just Gucci. Like I know a lot of people like on social media swears that they hate Gucci, but. I live in slides too, so he, he I know. He slept with them, he took a shower with them. <laughs> so. I know. So he was like, like me, I love my slides. I take them everywhere. So si me faltan mis slides, I'm like, where's my slides? It's like your chanclas, you know? Like si te faltan tus chanclas, like you want your chanclas. Yeah. So there was a trip that we came to and I can't remember which one it was that we brought Arnoir with us. It was a couple months back, no? I have yeah. to remember what we came for. Oh, it was Melina's birthday party. Oh yeah. And we stopped to two rest areas. I think it was the last rest area that we stopped in. And I remember Melody asked him, oh, can you get off the truck to look for I don't know what? So he had to get off. I don't know, el caso de que we ended up driving off, you know? We get home and he's like, where's my slides? I know he thought if we had them in our bag and I'm like, no, he thought we were pranking them. Like maybe when you opened the door, they fell and you didn't see them, you know? like. They fell up by the gas station or something. He digged through our whole truck. They cleaned out the truck and those slides were nowhere to be mm -hmm. found. And my question to him was like, didn't you get off with them to the rest area? He's like, yeah, but where was his shoes? So I hold this guy's old rest area, what happened? I it's a mystery. I think he had different shoes or different sandals, no, I'm not sure. That's what he was wearing. That's he took them one. off. It was just a mystery, guys, that till this day, he's like, where did my slides go? Like, mm -hmm. it's like a, it's funny, but it's a mystery. So we're, I'm, I want to think that either they fell off and both of them did, you know, and we drove off. Well, yeah, like a blanket too. So I figured maybe they were like in the, in the cobijas and then maybe you just maybe se, cayeron. Them, se cayeron or something, you know, but. But they're so heavy. Anyway, guys, to this day, it's a mystery. Mm -hmm. So we were like, what should we get him? And he's always like, oh, I miss my, my slides. I miss my slides. And I was like, there you go. I need to get him his slides for his birthday. You guys know we love surprising everyone around us so he was so happy and so thankful and we felt bad you know because it was on our trip it was only right for us to get him his chanclas back he used them so much guys that the gucci signs were like flipping they look like the mcdonald's sign now. <laughs> all right guys so let's get going <laughs> ethan decided to come on a trip with mommy and daddy <laughs> so he's on winter break right now and he decided to come with us we're also and, visiting my mama oh yeah we're gonna go to the cemetery um, and Angelique is loving it. Como te grita? Ethan! Ethan! I've been her babysitter the whole time. Tampoco, tampoco. <laughs> she hasn't even been drinking this, her This tripping free. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so we are here for her photo shoot. I didn't do her hair because we have no idea what headband we're going to use. Yeah. So I didn't want to mess up her hair. Hold on, I wanted to show them this right here. Like guys, this is when, when Candy was pregnant. I might take this home. <laughs> no, we might do another one. So beautiful. She also got like cool little dresses. Like this. You got this little Santa right here. So cute, guys. Look at all the stuff she has for maternity. Mm -hmm. So, if you guys are ready to see Angelique, give this video a big thumbs up. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Okay, 
You know what? Because she wants to walk already. <laughs> oh no, that's too early. <laughs> I need to like tighten the bolt so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Good! Yay, Mama! <laughs> mama, you look beautiful, my amor! Mira, Mama! Shall we? Now that you showed me, she doesn't stop and then you turn her. <gasps> She'll never stop. I know how to do her hair back and forth already. <laughs> She's ready. She looks pretty. You're ready. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Hey, baby. Put her with her, her back, like towards this, this way. Yeah. So she's facing. Oh, wait, like, Malaya. Like, Hold on, let me grab some marshmallows. Like, Mama? <laughs> it almost overflowed. Alright, guys, so we. <laughs> she overflooded the thing. There's a different scene here. We're putting in hot cocoa. Mama, to this place. Marshmallows right here. You're gonna get a marshmallow, don't worry. You know, Mama, marshmallows? Nice little set up here, guys. A ver, Angelique, voltea. Mama? We are all done with the photo shoot oh my god guys i am so obsessed i cannot believe how well behaved and how much fun she had huh it was like yeah. the perfect timing to take her because sometimes she gets like really sleepy and we were kind of like iffy about it we were like oh my god is she getting sleepy but on the way there she was just watching coco melon so we're like this is the perfect timing you know yeah. and she's really good with her like she even told me like if you know she's gonna fall asleep like we can come at a later time so she was so active too she like, was laughing and it was crazy yeah. she has so much fun uh -huh. i think that she enjoyed that and, and i was, was a little scared because como she moves too much i thought she wasn't gonna like cooperate it's one of the like, most uh easier photos we had because we yeah. usually like struggle with her yeah like, just smile or something you know? but i can see so mm -hmm. we are obsessed i cannot wait to see the pictures i yeah. will be linking all her information below guys that way you guys can contact her if you guys are ever in california or if you guys live in california she's a good photographer too she's really good with kids guys. Yeah. yeah so guys we are here at the cemetery before we do head back home we are going to be going back home today we're only here just for the photo shoot because i really wanted to bring her with her to do her photo shoot um we came to the cemetery to visit nestor's mom if you guys have been with us for a long time you guys know that my dad and nestor's mom are in the same cemetery mm -hmm. and actually on the 21st is nestor's 10 year his mom's yeah. 10 year anniversary that she left us we were supposed to get um all of my brothers were going to get together and get mariachi but i guess there's rules here that of COVID. Yeah, so they didn't allow it, so yeah. we couldn't do that. Um, I'm just by to give her some flowers and, mm -hmm. and we got a little her. you got her a little tree. Yeah. So tree we'll show flowers. you guys a little bit of that. I didn't think that they would allow um people to put decorations. Look how much decorations there is here. It's so pretty here too. It's all green. I don't think your mom is this far. I think she's like over here. So Nestor brought her some red flowers and then a little Christmas tree. <laughs> so cute. Now we have to go look for my dad's because I always forget. I think your dad's over. My sister came yesterday. You tell. Huh? Yeah. Came for a day. 
All right, guys, so we came by to get something to eat, and obviously we had to come by my rancho, and no, I'm just kidding. Rancho. I tell, I tell them all the time, like, it's my rancho, it's my, where I grew up. Well, I love coming to La Puente, California, because I was raised here. So we're gonna get something to eat. I love being, just by being on Valley Boulevard, if you guys are from here, you guys know what I'm talking La about. La Puente. But we're gonna eat here at Taconazo. I'm obsessed with Taconazo and their ceviche de pescado. Well, we always come here before we leave the Phoenix. So. Yep, always. This is shit. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we already got our food, and now it's Nestor's turn. Because Nestor and Ethan are craving chili cheese fries from Reese's. So, guys, the reason why we come here is because in Phoenix, there's nothing like this. Like, in Phoenix, it's hard to find good food. So right here. No, there's a lot of good food in Phoenix, yeah, but, but mostly, not like back home, feel, you know? Yeah, I feel like Phoenix has more like ceviche. No, no but, here it's like burgers, got ceviche, got tacos. Hey, you can't complain. Phoenix has um, food now. Now. It took years though. Yeah. You know we've always called it creases, but I think it's Chris's. Creases. I mean, whatever. It's Chris. bomb. Chris's? Mm -hmm. Look, guys. These are the chili cheese fries. These are fire, bro. They're so bomb. I'm going to show you guys the rest of the food right now. Let me show you guys the tacos from Taconazo. Los tacos de papa. Look how bomb they look. They're literally tacos dorados like this. Also got some fish tacos. I already ate half of it, but my ass was hungry. Ceviche de pescado. It is so bomb. And they give you this salty chile huero. Mmm. It's bomb. I love eating in these two places. You're crazy. Mm hmm Let me tell you guys something. It's 4 o'clock in Cali. 5 in AZ. And we're barely having breakfast. That's how you know we're busy all the time. That's how you guys know we're busy. For the past two vlogs, we haven't had breakfast till like four or five o'clock. It's bad. Mmm. Yo, you're dirty. Let me lick you. <laughs> guys, yeah, Angelique yeah. woke up and she's eating una papa. Is it yummy, mama? Yeah. <laughs> what are you gonna do? I'm tired. <laughs> Just like, what are you gonna do with this money? What are you gonna do with this money? What are you gonna do with this money? A hundred dollars make you holler. You're so beautiful, mama. You're so mean. Ethan. Ethan. That's all I should have let her say. Ethan. So she has been saying Ethan's name nonstop. It randomly, she'll be like, Ethan. Yeah. So it's really funny. We've been trying to catch it on camera, as you guys saw. But she does say it more clear sometimes. So, oh, yeah, so she said it. All right, guys, so we're gonna be closing down the video right here because we wanna make sure that we close on the video. We always forget to do that. That's yeah. why you guys see us days after closing down our videos. But before we do leave, our $100 giveaway winner goes out to? To, drum roll, to Isabella Padilla. Shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for being part of our family, for having your post notifications on, and always showing us so much love. If you guys want to be our next $100 giveaway winner, all you have to do is subscribe to Aguilar, turn your post notifications, and comment your cash app down below. Do not forget that we're also doing an iPhone giveaway. The winner will be announced pretty soon on Christmas Day video. For that, you guys just have to subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and share on your social medias. Tag us. Use the hashtag, the Aguilar iPhone giveaway. With that being said, guys, do not forget that we love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.